hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough we're starting stage four the factory stage battling our way to brain bomber with of course four one so as the beginning stage i don't know why i have to point that out but uh, okay <laughs> uh this my spiky bomb here might actually come in handy on this particular stage here because of the fact that it's just going to chew through the blocks like crazy and hello there, Pac-Man guy. Are you one of those guys that eat my... Yes, you are one of the ones that eat bombs. <laughs> oh, okay, you're just like the blue guy from the last game. If there's so and so many squares away, it'll see... And if you if it sees you drop a bomb, it'll go after your bomb. And those guys are pretty proficient at dodging bomb blasts. Curses! <laughs> those little walking guys. I'm pretty sure they take two hits to the feet as well. Hello there. Oh, those guys make blocks. They can use them to defend themselves as well as just block your way, you know, block you into things. I guess that was sort of a pun there. Oh, jeez, I hit the door. Well, at least I didn't get, uh, I mean, at least I didn't uh, respawn the, the super fast guy. That would be kind of annoying. <laughs> the super fast guy really gets in your way. And there's the door. Woo! Happy days! Yeah, what does this factory make, anyway? It's, it looks like it's making the very platforms that we're battling on, or something like that. I don't know. I don't. I think that these things, they don't hurt you, but they push you off edges if you let them. So be very careful about that. <laughs> yeah. And I don't think you can destroy them, either. Nope. They took no damage from that whatsoever. Good to know, I suppose, for the future? Uh, I just want to make sure that there's some... You know, I, I take care of all the enemies on this side first by blasting all the blocks. As you've seen before, there's a little gimmick that all the enemies are... Well, okay, not all the enemies, but a lot of the enemies are hidden beneath blocks. And you gotta make sure that you get them all before you go to the next area so you don't, like, miss out or something like that. Uh, platform will appear over there. Oh, and you can't fall into the abyss normally by just, like, walking off the edge. You have to be pushed off by one of those odd orbish pusher thingies. I have no idea what the heck they're called. <laughs> they're not enemies, but they certainly don't help you in the slightest. No, no! How dare you? You know, that door is like completely out of the way. Even if I laid a bomb here, that would do absolutely nothing because bomb blasts do not go, go through those things. Alright, I'm just gonna take advantage of all that. Beautiful. So let's switch. Turn on that platform, that one, the, that now lit up green one at the far upper right corner there. I'm gonna take care of that guy. Good. That should open the door. I think. Yep. Woo! Not too hard. Maybe this game isn't as hard as I remember it to be. Every, it's like, you when you're a kid, things seem to be a whole lot harder than they are when you are an adult, and you know you think through your moves a lot more. There's another heart. Wow. Uh, I'm pretty sure that red guy over there, he uh, blasts through blocks. I should probably test that in a later area. Uh, like, he, he, I think that red guy acts as if he was a spike bomb sort of gimmick thing. Oh my. <laughs> how do I... Uh, how do I solve this puzzle? Well, I can do... Oh no, I can't. Well, if I put this here, I'll hit those first three switches. Um, oh wait, I can do it like this, and then put a bomb there, which will reverse those two switches, and then put a bomb there, which will reverse them back. Alrighty, we're good to go. Sometimes your uh, larger bomb blast indeed gets in the way of puzzles like that, so you're gonna have to think through things that you wouldn't normally have to think through quite as much. Oh jeez, another one of those guys. Oh no, 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 you will not steal my clothing. Yeah, that's their whole intent. They want to steal your clothes. They want to leave you naked. Um, hmm. Oh, I can't hit that. I mean, I can't blast those just yet because I'll hit the door. <laughs> I don't feel like counting squares, to be honest. Because otherwise I just have to hit it with the tip of my explosion. You know, that last block rather than touch the door. And I'm definitely missing some... It's one of those, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, guess I'm going to have to count it. Like there, I think. Too far. Dang it! <laughs> but yeah, there was one hidden right on those... Oh, it was nine squares. I counted nine to the center of the bomb blast and not towards the tip. I am an idiot. 
Oh, well, I guess that's okay. I'll be able to take care of these guys quick enough, I, I think. Eh, no, please, dear lord. <laughs> so aggressive. All right, we're good. Unless that guy pushes me off the edge, which he won't. So I'm gonna have to go all the way back to the beginning as he respawns all the enemies, apparently. Arr! <laughs> Luckily, there's a generous amount of time here, or maybe it just seems generous because I'm whoa, really powered up, and there goes my power up. <laughs> well, I should say my heart power up. Oh, what a shame. Such a shame. It's a good thing I had that heart, though, otherwise I'd have to restart this sucker from the beginning. And, whew, and I just could have got pushed off the edge there for a one-hit kill, no matter what kind of... Uh, item I had in my inventory. Uh, maybe I'm being a little bit too hasty now. I'm being o overconfident. <laughs> I must carefully think about my moves and blast each enemy one by one. And you did a great job of dodging that. <laughs> Seriously, he dodged that as good as I did. I should say as good as I would. You're gonna come. Yeah, I knew there was gonna be one there. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Try to trap them. There we go. That works. And I can't hit. I'm just gonna blast that just to be sure. You know, just I want to make sure there's no enemies there first, <laughs> because you know I'm in control of the area, so it's like I might as well. Okay, now be careful here. You want to put a bomb and run, 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 run. <laughs> oh come on! There's one of them. And seriously, I'm gonna have to time with. Uh... Okay, what's your firepower anyway? Infinite, wow! <laughs> oh jeez! No, no, no! Oh, I got the kick! I forgot I got- Wait, I had another heart? A heart stack? What? Or, or did I get another heart from something else? I wasn't really paying much attention there. Where- where did I get an extra hit from? Huh. Okay, these- anyway, these stairs right here, they're blastable. So what you want to do is put a bomb off to the side and watch this! Extra life, little critter! Woohoo! And there's the door. Actually, that's the end of the stage. You know where the door is, dang it. <laughs> Four, five. Let's get it going. You know, I, I really like to get rid of this. Um, red bomb power up. There. I mean, the spike ball power up there because it is. Maybe I should just like kill myself just to get rid of it or something like that. It's, it's sort of getting in the way at times, <laughs> if you didn't realize that. Eh. And you're going down, baby. Yeah, you're too fast for your own good. Any enemies on under there? Yes, there is one more. This is a really tight area to battle these guys, though you can use your bombs to protect yourself from them moving in, into your area. Woo! Eh, that's enough of that. <laughs> um, I should probably, like, do this. Oh, I can't drop a bomb on that light switch. Curses! My plan has been ruined. I don't I don't think there's anything for me over on the other area on the left. There we go! Remote control bombs. Now that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> and since I hit all those, all those switches, it looks like they aren't turning themselves on and off any more and I didn't pay attention to the door in the slightest oh and that it actually respawned that guy this time that that is unfortunate <laughs> I might as well go back to the start right away and blast those other two that are on the other side you know actually that might be a problem if they're like in my way and wandering around it might me it might take me a few passes before I can get onto that platform safely or not <laughs> that works great one down. Oh, no. This way. Wait, actually, I'm going to stand here. Good. Because I believe they sort of go and aim for you, in a way. So, you don't want to... I mean, you want to lead them into a place that they'll get caught up in your bomb blast. Alright. So, now I have... Oh, and I forgot to mention that kick power-up that I had. Or I, I should say that I still have to use the kick power up. You just walk into a bomb. Only it looks like I have a bo a bomb walk power up as well, and I wasn't really paying much attention. Uh, the difference between a bomb walk and a normal bomb power up is that it's got little swipes of like air across the bomb 
uh, power up item thing, and I'm gonna blast those stairs just for the fun of it. <laughs> so, yeah. It looks like I'm more power up than I thought I was, actually. I wonder when I picked up those other power ups. I was just like collecting things randomly. And, you know, I was just picking up things and wasn't really paying attention to explaining them at all. And there's another heart. Wow. Yeah, this game is definitely not as hard as I remember it. Not that that's a bad thing in the slightest. I would still uh, prefer this game over the original Bomberman because it's got so much more to it, so to speak. Um, to where? Whoa! Work my way over there. And it looks like the, the enemies don't hurt you when they touch you and they're flashing. That's interesting. Um, I have to do it like that. Good. Gonna move on. Wait, can I? If I were to put a bomb here, can I like? Yeah, they stop the bomb blast if they're in the way of your bomb blast. I just wanted to confirm that for myself, just to be sure. For the future, uh, I need to make a platform. No, I don't have to make a platform appear in the center. I could just like, yeah, do one of these things. What? Why would I want to make a platform in the center? Is that just like a shortcut of some sort? Oh shoot, why did I do that? Ah, they're in the each other's bomb blast radius, and if you didn't realize, bombs blow up each other if they're touched by a bomb blast. That's kind of realistic, actually. <laughs> I mean, a bomb is certainly going to explode another bomb. <laughs> and since I respawned... I mean, no wait, I didn't respawn. What am I thinking? Wait, wait, did I respawn the enemies down there? I did, didn't I? Because I hit... Yeah, the door was hit, alas. So I have to go back down here. Or that didn't take long at all, so it doesn't really matter. And... There we go. Yeah, I don't see the point of that platform in the center. Unless it's like just for, for like a safe escape route. Because I don't think anything can hurt you on those platforms. Boss time! And... He's actually a pretty weak boss. He he has the remote control power up, but the thing is is that he's only got one fire power. <laughs> it's like what's the point of having a remote control power up if you only have one fire power? You won't be able to trick anyone with that and <laughs> and he strangely t is taken down really quickly as well. Oh well, I guess. I still have my gloves, so I'll be able to defeat this boss with ease, I believe. Because I, I could just throw bombs on top of its head, and I believe it's one, another one of those bosses that stay at the top of the screen if I... Oh no wait, it's not! I'm thinking of the final boss. And this is going to be quite the battle. <laughs> okay, it's not really quite the battle, it's not that hard at all. It's Because I have the remote control here, so I'm going to be taking advantage of that like crazy. Uh, he does seem to follow you. And are you ever gonna drop your bomb? There we go. Um, that bomb blast right there can hurt him, and it goes in that pattern that you've seen. So it's pretty easy to avoid, and he's also pretty slow, especially if you're powered up with... Wow, that was fast! Especially if you're powered up with the roller skates. Well, I hope you enjoyed this part, and I will see you in the next part. Oh, that was strangely meta night like you know, in the Kirby games. <laughs> <laughs> with the whole cape falling to the ground thing. You get what I'm talking about. Hope you enjoyed, as I said, doo -doo!